Hello there everybody, I'm Pixar, and as I've said, it's Newsweek, and I have another news video. LEGO Star Wars sets have been revealed! Yes, we got like, I think, six set photos, and Amazon already revealed this one, but let's go into it anyway. Let's start with the Resistance ones. Yeah, the new Resistance uh, little uh, TV show. This uh, is, I believe, a $40 set, or maybe $30, anyway. Um, either way, I think um, $40 is a bit of a stretch. $35 would be ideal. $30 would be a good deal. $40 would be a bit of a stretch. Anyway, we get an old Leia again. Yeah, another chance to get her instead of from Star 7. Uh, a new pilot right there with a the green jacket. Looks like he should be a main character. A droid. That one looks kind of funny. And then I think um, a pilot for the tie, though, in red. Anyway, here's another one, and that is uh, Poe Dameron. And then a pilot, though, sleeveless? That's weird for a tie pilot. And then, I don't know, I haven't watched any of the show. Like, a lot of people hate it on Rebels. I still actually watch that, but this, I just can't take the animation style. And then we got another BB-8. So, yeah, good half for that up. And this seems to be a $30 set. So, yeah, I think that proves that the other one is $40. But let's move on to some other ones. Uh, these are weird. I'm going to show them in a second, but I want to talk about them first. These are called action packs. Yeah, so these are great! Finally a chance to get an Ewok and a Scout Trooper. Right, so this is a great concept. It should be uh, $15. Uh, you have a little place for the Ewok, a little place for the speeder. Though here's the thing. They have, um, the uh, for a game, they included the Technic Cannon. So one would be the Resistance, the blue side, one would be the red side. Now, I love the build. Though I think the Technic Cannons kind of take away and the Target Signs definitely take away. Though here's the thing. I believe with just minor customization, just leave them off, and it will be completely fine. And then we have more hot stuff on the market. Hey, that's good. We got the shield generator, then a little turret, and the same game system. I don't know about the prices for these. They seem to be $20 each for the Ewok one and now for this one. Though, again, I'm so happy to get the Ewok one online and now, uh, sorry, not online, on the market. And then now we have a snow trooper here and a hot soldier. Yeah, good stuff to get. Um, and I'm just... um. Uh, I just really hope that it's easy to take the targets off. And it would be cool, though, if you hit the target, like, things explode. And then here's the big one. Yeah, this looks good. You got an at not that big. This seems like a $40 set, which is a great price, because um, now no one has to get that terrible UCS hot. Like, look, you got the turret, you got the gate, and then you got the shield generator in the other set, in at at, and then you got um, a, 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 a bit of terrain. And then two cannons. I just... Again, my only concern is whether or not the um, kind of um, targets will be able to come off. And good thing for the bigger structures, more uh, targets. Anyway, Amazon Elite accidentally revealed this, though now we get clearer pictures that Lego revealed. So anyway, this is a great set, $20, um, and it's been rumored. And uh, this seems like a $15 set, though guys, don't explain. Uh, I mean, don't complain. Like, let me explain. <laughs> Ray and... Um, Kylo Ren in the same set, that's great, only for $20, it's not that expensive, and I think it's uh, a good diorama, though definitely, um, if you, it bothers you that much, just wait for it to go, um, on sale on Walmart, but that's it for this video.